vegetable dish that keeps well in the fridge is always a welcome addition to our repertoire. Broccoli salad with salty bacon and sweet cranberries is hearty and refreshing. My name is Willow and this is Uni de Bento. Let's make lunch! All right, so I'm gonna start with our dressing. This is a half cup of mayonnaise. This is three tablespoons of vinegar. And then one tablespoon of sugar. You can add more sugar. I tend to go a little on the lighter side with sugar just because too sweet just gets a bit too much very quickly. I'll give that a quick mix. I'm curious, do you guys mind the bird pictures? I thought they were funny and it seems I can't keep her out of things, even if I try. So I figured I'd integrate her and just throw in little tidbits that maybe I forgot or I find are really helpful. So let me know what you, what you think. So in this bowl, I'm throwing in uh, three to four cups of broccoli. It really depends on your preferences. This is about four strips of bacon, just rough cut. Now this is one full shallot. I usually soak, especially if you're eating them raw, I soak shallots in cold water to help remove some of that bite that they can have sometimes. You'll know when you're cutting it up if it's got that bite or not. So I soaked them in cold water. You just wring them out a little bit and then throw in as much as you enjoy. If you don't like any sort of onion, allium, leave it out. It's all up to you. I find they add a crispness or a freshness, I guess, to anything broccoli related. Kind of like adding green onions to things. I love doing that too. So here we're going to throw in our sauce, but we're not going to throw it all in at once. Because sometimes things will give off a little more water. You don't feel like that much sauce today. I eyeball most of my measurements, so sometimes it's a little off and that's okay. And we're just gonna toss until the broccoli is all coated. Okay, so when that's all mixed in, you're gonna throw in cranberries. If you don't like cranberries, leave them out. Throw in like pecans or something, that might add that, that sweetness and add a little nuttiness. I don't, I can't handle a lot of nuts, so I don't bother, but it's an option that you have. And how many cranberries you throw in is completely up to you. Uh, some people use sunflower seeds. Again, I can have a hard time with nuts sometimes. Nuts and seeds, it seems, I just avoid them. But it's a nice, easy salad to do. Since it's broccoli and it's still raw, you can keep it in the fridge for usually three to four days, depending on how small you cut it up. The smaller you cut it up, the shorter it's gonna last in the fridge. So there you go. One more side dish, perfect for your bento. I hope you give it a try. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time.